Okay, you guys, lesson one, gut-brain connection. Hey there, ready to get in control of your mental fitness? Knowledge is power. Let's get you empowered and in command. But first, let's get some simple concepts down. Everyone knows the brain is top dog and is in charge of carrying out what it thinks is in the best interest of our body's survival. Now, the brain listens to the needs of the body and it makes decisions based on that information. It just so happens that there is a, a hotline, if you will, between the gut, the intestines, and the brain. This hotline is a long nerve called the vagus nerve, V-A-G-U-S. The vagus nerve stretches from the base of the skull all the way down to the intestines. This nerve stays very busy, as it always, it's always relaying information back and forth between the brain and the very, very demanding intestines. Why are the intestines so demanding? The answer is because of the amount of responsibility they have to police carefully what comes in and out of the body. When things are good and the wall of the gut is strong and functioning perfectly to absorb healthy vitamins, healthy minerals, healthy nutrients, healthy fats, healthy proteins, healthy carbs, life is good. But when disruption of this crucial barrier and balance system occurs, it sends things into crisis mode. When the gut fears a breach of its defenses, it immediately communicates with the brain and asks for help. The brain is obligated to oblige and it sets the immune system in motion, right or wrong. And please recall that the immune system's job is to increase inflammation, which functions to fix broken things and fight foreign invaders to the death. In the interest of destroying invaders and disruptors, the immune system will unfortunately cause crowding, damage, and sometimes permanent problems to ordinary body tissues and systems. Just like in war, civilians are often the majority of casualties. The idea is to keep you alive no matter the cost. It is a survival mechanism with enormous consequences. So before we go any further, can you see what chronic, relentless inflammation from a disrupted gut can do? Pick any tissue, pick any organ, or pick any body system and imagine what chronic inflammation can do to it over time. Nothing good. So chronic inflammation is the initial cause of virtually all disease processes. Cancer, cardiovascular disease, diabetes, chronic pain, autoimmune disease, dementia, and more, they're all initiated by inflammation. Aren't you glad you now understand this? Knowledge truly is power. But let's go further. I want you to know that you can actually help your gut and your brain communicate better to calm things down. It's almost like couples therapy, and the lifeline of communication is the vagus nerve. By stimulating this critical line of communication, you can increase the tone and the output of this system. Attached to this lesson is a simple but powerful tool that you can use in order to see if you have any weak spots in your gut-brain connection. The cool thing is, you can actually do some simple exercises in order to supercharge this valuable system. Please open and have a look at the easy vagus nerve assessment and exercise document that's included in this module. Take some quiet time to carefully assess yourself. It is an easy concept. The exercise is the test. Anything you happen to fail or score low on it is actually the simple exercise you should perform daily. It's literally that easy. Reassess yourself every couple weeks and watch your improvement. If you struggle with little to no improvement, please reach out to us as you may benefit from a simple yet very powerful vagus nerve stimulator, which is simu it's similar to a TENS unit that people use to help muscle spasms. Getting the vagus nerve under control is a game changer for many people. Fatigued brain-gut connections due to stress occur in basically everyone. Don't overlook this item. It can magnify your gut restoration efforts. So you've come so far. You now know concepts about your body that many doctors do not or they just ignore. Let's push hard ahead with your why at the forefront of your mind. Thanks, you guys.